Hello, genuine people of the internet. How are you doing? Great. I'm doing, well, all right. I was thinking about why not have a contest for INTPs or anyone else. You can be anyone and participate in this contest. And, um, well, see where it goes. Um, I'm thinking about potentially creating a, a video with the different um, contestants, people submitting to it. What is the contest, you ask? Well. I was really bored in Kansas one day, and I wrote a monologue slash soliloquy thing, and I thought it was interesting. It was a, it's a highly philosophical statement that, well, I'll leave it up to your interpretation. And I was thinking, hey, why not share this for um, with the rest of the internet and have you guys a, um, say it. Um, in some dramatic or whatever fashion that you find most clever or creative and in the end make a compilation of all the different um, submissions to it. So, um, I'm going to tell you uh, the, the soliloquy um, or monologue, I guess it depends how you say it. Um, it'll also be in the description below. Um, but also, so, yeah, make a video of you saying it preferably like if you were um, uh, remember if you've memorized it or something and be creative with it like have lighting and camera or Whatever something interesting or cool and something however it inspires you to articulate uh, the words being said um, If you have music just make sure that it's not uh, like copyright or anything because I would love to publish them or like put them on the YouTube channel and not have to have them be banned or anything silly because of copyright issues. Um, and so, yeah, but if you have music like either you made it or a friend made it or something, then you all are in good standing. Um, and what else? Oh, yeah, and send it to me via email or Dropbox. Just email me at erictheintp, all one word, at gmail.com. The email is also in the description. Uh, what else? Yeah, so just make a video of you doing it, email it to me, and then I'll comp uh, compile them together. And I'll also put in my own for the fun of it. And... Well, we'll see where it goes. All right, <laughs> and this isn't a real umbrella. This is like a light um, diffuser for those things. Hmm. So here is the soliloquy, and I'm not going to dramatize it. <laughs> it's just so I don't um, influence, hopefully, too much um, any of the uh, nuances or whatnot. <laughs> but it's also in the description below. So, the heart of man knows only war. If not struck into order, it will rise up and inspire chaos. And in amidst the chaos, we learn to fear a false tyrant forged from the complacency of our own corruption. If a man battles, or if a man straightens not his crooked path, the heart will convince others must bow to its wandering. If a man battles not his demons, the heart will inveigle him into cherishing every part of its perversion. All who challenge his twisted desires will be marked as an enemy. Like slaves beaten by a wicked master, so are we if the heart conquers our vulnerable spirit, and if at that time we should wake, we will find a world torn apart by our own hands, or by our hands. Uh, vague will be our wisdom, and desperate will be our eyes for not recognizing the heart as the true tyrant. Mmm, yes! <laughs> so, that's it. Now, I might have missed a word or two in there, but I would love to hear how you guys say it in some dramatic or comedic function or fashion or whatever. Uh, send it to me, and yeah, it's just kind of whenever. And... Yeah, you don't have to be an ITV. Anybody can do this. Anyone. So, I look forward to seeing your submissions, good sirs and madams of the internet. And I'll see you in another video in a little bit. Actually, we'll be in the same video. So, we'll, like, we'll be seeing each other in the same video. And it's like almost like another life. Wow. This is incredible. All right. See ya.